audience a group of people who participate in a show or encounter a work in this day and age we are used to mainstream types of audiences ranging from sports games concerts as well as public events however there is a rising art the art of gaming Uh, usually very geeky. So if you're like, you're very nerdy at the same time. Be like, you know, the fat guy says computer. Nerd. <laughs> geeky classes, I suppose. Well, I would agree to some extent because, like, I definitely fit the bill. Well, but it's only like superficially. Like, only on the outside, our gamers may look like this, but it can be anyone. Ah, uh, yeah, it's like society is responsible for many kinds of stereotyping, not just gamers, like even like cultures and people in general. And yeah, it's like uh, a number of, yeah, a multitude of people can go into gaming. It's like, well, you can have like a nine to five job and still be a gamer. It's like even like, that hot chick who lives across the hall, she might be a gamer. Well, surprisingly, it brings people together. It's like, say, like for example, like you're playing an online game, but uh, none of your friends are online, and you want to do like a raid or like a mission together. So like you go to an online lobby, find people, and surprisingly, people will be willing to join you and like do the mission or something. And more often than not, like you, you exchange like gamer tags and contact each other over a span of a long time. Well, I think it's fun in general. It's a good stress buster, I guess. Well, to be honest, like don't generalize, don't stereotype. I mean, well, try to find a gaming community. You can see like there's a multitude of people there, like different types of people, married men, like kids even, like, yeah, it's, it's a broad spectrum.